My name's Savannah. My fiance Joe really wants to see me in a traditional lace white dress, which is not really what I've bought. As soon as I came back from the shop last time, Joe was like, you did choose white, didn't you? I was like, uh, you'll find out on the day. Like, oh my God, I have not chosen a white dress. Morning, Savannah. Hey, are you okay? Yes, are you? Yeah, fine, thank Get you. excited? <laughs> yeah, really excited. Getting close now? I know, not long at all. I'll take you up to Ava. Thank you. Oh, Savannah, she is absolutely a little bit of a firecracker. You know, she's not going to suffer fools or end up being lumped with something that she doesn't like. It's five weeks. You're getting married. <gasps> <It's> Mrs. Armstead. <laughs> a bit weird. Me and Jo have known each other for 11 years now. We met at a Bradford Ice Rink, of all places. Savannah fell in love with my skills. <laughs> yeah, on the ice hockey team, this one. Everyone wanted to Joe to be their boyfriend because he was right good at going backwards and stuff like that. <laughs> I have a perfect image of Savannah. I think she looks nice always, but I hope to see her in like a sort of like French lace back. Definitely white. Do you think that you'll cry when you see me? Yeah, of course I will. Hello! Hi! Yes, I'm nervous. No, but what are you nervous for? I'm scared about being too big and oh, the wrong shit. colour and... Wrong colour? All that sort of stuff, yeah. I've definitely been super stressed by the amount of comments I've had from Joe about me wearing a white dress. I've honestly got to a few weeks away now and it's really starting to concern me. Let's just put it on and see how we feel, OK? okay. This can go one or two ways, I'm not really sure. If there's anything that isn't right, we've got to say. Yeah. But then I'm worried she's going to go into full meltdown. Yeah, yeah. and you don't want that. Because she does not handle stress well. No. Yeah, I'm glad I've, I've gone for this colour. But I think I need everyone else to agree. Yeah, you just need that kind of clarification. Yeah, that it was the right thing to do, because this is not what Joe's going to expect me to be wearing. Yeah. At all. If I go out now and my entourage are not happy with the colour of it, I literally will buy another one today. I just want to see it so I know what the next month of my life is going to be like. <laughs> All of them. You know, lives. like... <laughs> I think we'll be able to see from her face when she comes out, though, what she's thinking. If yeah. she's right, we'll know, and if it's not, then we're really going to know about her. Yeah. There she is. <gasps> oh, my God. Oh, OK. Oh, my God. <gasps> oh, my God. What do you think, guys? <laughs> You'll do. You look gorgeous. I am proud of her. She, oh my God, she brought tears to my eyes. She just looked beautiful, but it's, it's that person that she is on the inside, really, that I feel so proud about. What do you think of the colour, though? You look beautiful. Yeah, I just really hope that Joe thinks the same that we think. Cost who How are can you? he not? She's beaming, she looks great, she looks happy. And that's all we want, for her to come out and look happy. That was it. Do you yeah, feel, I love it. Do you feel amazing? I feel like I'm getting married yet. <laughs> <laughs> this is absolutely the reaction I needed. I'm totally reassured that I've chosen the right dress. You promise you're not lying? No, we would tell you. Right. Did you see all the faces? <laughs> not like that. Just got to be making sure. <laughs> Can we see what it would look like bigger? Make it a bit bigger, yeah. 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 Can you manage? Yeah. I just want to explore the idea of trying um, an underskirt just to see if maybe bringing that out a little bit might make it that little bit more. She needs to be that fairy tale for the one day. How does that feel? That is too big. <laughs> that is ridiculous. Oh my God, this underskirt is way too big. I'm going to be tugging it up all day. What we'll do, though, we'll still show them, um, get their opinions as well, but, yeah, it is. What if Trish Oops. really loves it, though, like this? I'm pretty scared that my mum is going to love this. I'm going to have to talk her down about it. Could you imagine bumping down the aisle in that big, massive dress? Never mind getting down there, I won't be able to go to the toilet. Right, well, we'll go show them anyway, and we'll just see what they think. Right, OK. OK. Definitely have... <laughs> 
concerns thinking about the aisle, just how big that skirt could be getting down it. It's quite skinny, the church. I mean, down, it is an old, there, yeah. you know, like traditional just church. It's really small. Push it down. <laughs> <laughs> so we've gone big. Okay. We've gone big, we've gone big. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. She's waddling in, the dress is just far too big. She's definitely waddling. This ain't right. Yeah, how does it feel? This is way too big. <laughs> is it? Yeah, Your face this is kind way of too that. big. You look like you're about to tip over. <laughs> I know. It's so big. <laughs> like, far too big. I look like Anne Boleyn or something. <laughs> <laughs> like my child could fit under this skirt. Yeah. It's massive. OK. It's far too big. I think trying... this is probably just one step too far. I don't know what you guys think. I agree. Yeah, yeah. I think it's on your face coming yeah. out as well. Yeah, your that. face was just bad. Yeah, you were like, I don't like this. No. No. I instantly thought, yeah, that is too big, really. Yeah. Can you manage? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so graceful. <laughs> Thud. <Yeah. laughs> this one's going to feel so much better. It's still got your tool in there, so it's going to give it volume. Um, but it's just not as much. Right, OK. So it's not going to be as heavy as well. I really hope this is the one, because I was so worried before, and that one was too big. Is this one going to be perfect? Here we go. I'm looking at the face. Yeah, the face looks better. <laughs> what do you reckon? Yeah. Aww. Yeah. That's it. That's it's, absolutely I love it. it. This time, it's right. It's not too big, it's not too small, it's perfect. Yeah, I'm happy. It's this perfect. Is, this is the one that I want. Oh, amazing. You look, you just, you look happy. Yeah, I am. Yeah. I'm really happy, I love it. I'm absolutely loving this underskirt. This is definitely the one. Everything just looks absolutely perfect and it shows off the skirt to the best of it could be. How did you get it so perfect? <laughs> Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome. I definitely feel like Joe's my soulmate because we're best friends above anything else. To have and to hold from this day forward. I think for me and Sav to finally be married, it's just like the icing on the wedding cake with her. My name's Jo. So far, I've been an indecisive bride. I've tried on over 200 dresses. I think you've got a case of dress blindness. She is so methodical. She won't settle until she feels like she's seen every dress that's available on this planet. Having tried on over 200 now, today has to be the day. Oh, my goodness. I have tried this, I have tried this. <laughs> I'm definitely afraid of committing to the dress. I just keep thinking to myself, what if this is the wrong decision? Joe's tried this one, do you remember this? I have tried that, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was the one in London, wasn't it? We've also seen this one, Nadine. I've tried this little poppy ah. bustier. And that, that is, in, in fact, on the spreadsheet as a shortlister. Sure so we're, st we're still this? thinking about that. Watching her pick them out one by one. I've this tried one, this, I yeah. Did. I've done this one, I've done this one, I've done this one. My heart just sank. Hi, Hi. nice to meet you. I'm Kay. Hi, how are you? Right? Good, thank you, yeah. Good. So, tell me about the boy. His name's Jack. He's my knight in shining armour. Jack and I have been together for just over three years now. He does absolutely everything for me and treats me like a princess. Talk to me about your dress. Okay. What are you looking for? Yeah, so I've tried on over 200 dresses now. <laughs> 200 dresses? <laughs> yep. Everyone's getting very bored. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what the problem is, why I can't connect with the one. Is that pictures of dresses or...? This are my spreadsheets, so... Uh, yeah. Spreadsheets? Very organised when it comes to planning the wedding. I've got a list of all the shops I've already been to, the dresses that are shortlisted. So have we condensed it down to a certain style? So we're edging more now towards these kind of fitted styles. Yeah. Halter necks are no good mm -hmm. or high necks are no good. Or something with thinner straps mm -hmm. tends to, to suit me, I think. So, here's dress 201. OK. <laughs> Hold down. I've gone for this one because it's not an all-over lace. You're nice bit of detailing, just flowing throughout the bodice, but yeah. then you go into this really beautiful lace skirt. 
and then it's got the most amazing train as well. Yeah. Tick mum's boxes, I think. I want my daughter to look like a bride and not to look like she's going to a ball. She is after the tradition, I'm after more of the trends. I'd love to be able to find a dress that we can compromise on, but it is a worry that we might not find it. I'm really intrigued about these spreadsheets. Yeah. It helps me to get everything out of my head and onto paper, and that relieves the stress a bit. Okay, I'll pull it up. If you just take a step forward for me. Okay, so I'm just gonna pin this all the way down. I want to see it in her face, like I want to see a, a change. I want to see tears. See. Let's not hold our breath. That's a, that's a nice silhouette. Whether it's totally wow, not sure yet. Are we happy to show yeah. your entourage? Yeah, let's. Yeah? Keen to see their opinions. Right. I love it. Mum's sold. <laughs> <laughs> I love the shape of it. I love all the detail on it. I love the train. I just love all of it. For me, it's not quite there. It's lacking that wow factor. Her face was just flat as a pancake. It's not grabbing her in any way. This dress is, is nice. Very formal, very bridal. That's why I like it. <laughs> but we're back at square one. OK, Joe. I have got dress number Ooh, two. Nice. So I've chosen this one next. OK. It's an illusion neckline. Yep. But it's really delicate. Once it's on the skin, it just looks like the lace is placed so beautifully. Okay. An illusion neckline doesn't tend to do much for me. It tends to rub and tends to drown me. So I'm not convinced I'm going to like this one when it's on. She's built up this commitment issue in her head and now we need to try and get her to shake it off. But I don't know how, it's getting worse. The more dresses we try, the really more different. fearful she is. Open your eyes. Oh, nice. We still say nice, though. Not quite connecting. I can't work out why. I'm, I'm scared of saying yes to the dress. I love, love the skirt. Also love the, the drop sides. Yeah. Love the back. Joe is saying love about this dress. I would say that this is progress, but it does still kind of feel a bit heavy on the top. Well, that's good though. We've had three loves. Yeah. That's a big, big positive, yeah, isn't definitely. it? Definitely. Right. Yeah. Let's see what everybody else thinks. It's maybe a little bit too sheer for what you were looking for, or are you okay with this? No, I'm actually okay with it. <laughs> It shocked me a bit that my mum does like this dress because it is on the sexy side and that's not what she was looking for. If this had spaghetti straps, yeah. I think we'd be onto a winner. Yeah, yeah, <gasps> totally yeah. agreed. I can't believe that after more than 200 dresses, she's just said this could be the one. I'm going to fall off my chair. We've got all these elements that you absolutely love. Mm -hmm. So I think now I need to just have another okay. look through. Let's go and find dress number three. Okay. So close. Yeah. Third time lucky, maybe. Yeah. I think when I find the right dress, and I'm hoping I do, there'll be a huge flood of relief come over me, and I'm looking forward to that, to be honest. Are you ready to see it? I am. Okay. Hold on to my hands. Okay. Open. Oh, nice. Nice. Very nice. And I don't just mean nice. <laughs> <laughs> Although I said nice, I did actually mean nice. It was really nice. Third, third time, time lucky. lucky. <laughs> or 203rd time yeah. lucky. <laughs> yes. Come on, dress number three. We are rooting for you. It's lovely. And you're actually yeah, crying. Like <laughs> you're all making me cry. <laughs> it's everything you've asked for, isn't it? Yep. Absolutely everything. She was literally glowing. She couldn't stop smiling. 
I never. <laughs> Stop it. Yeah. Yeah. Because it's been Did, a long journey. <laughs> yeah. The emotion that's coming out is just, she's happy. I've now got a big question for you. Are you going to say yes to the dress? What do we think, gang? It's not up to us. Yes. Yay! <laughs> My name's Jordi. Previously, I have done pageants, so I've obviously worn quite the glamorous dresses. We have obviously the glamorous accessories. So going on to get married, I obviously feel like I've got a big statement to prove. I can spark the one of them. Yeah. Today I brought along with me my lovely nan. Jordan, like you think that would suit me? My lovely mum and my lovely sister. I like it. It's very elegant and dainty. Oh, you get married. I don't want to get married. Hello! Hello. Hi. Jodie. Yes. Hello, Jodie. Nice Gok, nice to meet you. How are you? Mm -hmm. You I'm beautiful very well. thing. When are you getting married? Next July. Okay. Oh, great. A little bit of time then. Yeah. Tell me about the boy, because the boy's very, very important. Who yes. is he? So he's called Matthew. I don't think it was love at first sight when we first met. It wasn't meant to happen. It just like accidentally happened on purpose. You didn't really like me, did no, you? No, no. I just, me, I just yeah. kissed him for get back at someone, and then it went from there. <laughs> Sorry. Got any idea about the dresses already? Princess. Straight into the princess, yeah. Kathleen. I know exactly what she wants. She likes a low cut one here. All, all right she then, Kathleen. <laughs> I love my nan to pieces, don't get me wrong. She's like my best friend, but her opinion is so, so honest. She's so brutal. Her honesty is just sometimes too much. Headlights. Yeah, just headlights. Yeah. Perfect. Can't Knock us out. Brilliant. Okay. Okay. She always has to have the last, last word. Yeah. Yeah. And Mum, what are you thinking for the gorgeous Jodie? A little bit of a princessy feel, but just the, uh, the woe factor. So what do yeah. you want? I want um, fitted with a detachable train. What kind of budget we got to work with? So about 1500 to 2000 Nice. Mm -hmm. So let's work out exactly how, where you fit with it all, OK? Because okay? we've got very different dresses. Jodie's family want to see Jodie in a full-on princess gown, but she wants a fishtail with a detachable skirt, which is not surprising, considering she's an ex-pageant queen and she likes the drama. But now it's my turn to show them exactly what I can do. Let's find out exactly what our gorgeous entourage thinks. Should we start with you, Kathleen? Everything's gorgeous. The skirt is unbelievable. The top needs taking in more to your skin. I won't say it, that's the one for you until I've seen the others. I imagined it was something up here. So you Not think as... the shoulders are too bare? Yeah. Yeah, it is. OK, so a bit more structure on the shoulders. Fair enough. Yeah. Mum, yes. what are you thinking? The skirt is perfect. I'm not too sure on the sweetheart, the neck. The plunge, like, low plunge. Yeah, the plunge. It's a bit too much of a plunge. I feel like a million dollars. I just feel like everything I wanted to feel. This dress has just, just done it for me. Talk us through what you can see. Everything about it's perfect. The car set really does make the world a good. Right, spin round. Let's find out what your gorgeous, gorgeous family think. That is exactly what I would imagine for Jordi. Yeah, she looks amazing. Great. Mum, what were you thinking? Tira. Yeah, I love it. <laughs> Full. Do you like the detachable skirt? I do, yeah, I love it. I prefer it without that. I want, I want to have that on it. That's too plain for the dress. That's OK. I like the top. OK. Kathleen, do you want to see the beautiful gown I underneath the does. skirt? Yeah. Yes, I do. Should we do that? Yeah, right, I do, we'll do, I that. do. I wouldn't have that on, that other on it, no. That's lovely now. No, I'm that, glad that... you like it without as well, so you can at least half of the day, you can, yeah. you can... Yeah, at but... least you'll like my dress for the no, second half cheap, of the day. No, that cheap and the dress, that is beautiful. Yeah. It's not your typical 1920s exactly. dress. It's modern, it's contemporary. Oh, I don't think so. Not paying for that sudden daft thing right back of it. No. Oh. Oh, can you spoil that by covering it up? She's not spoiling it by covering it up. 
My nan's comments, which what I expected was very brutal. Sometimes I think she goes a bit over the top with the comments. If anyone would have had like some sort of gag or a pair of socks at that moment in time, I'd have probably shoved them in her mouth. I think Nan has got such a massive opinion about this, and we love our Nan. So I think Nan, you and I should go shopping together. Let's try and find a frock to put Jodie in. That means then, if Jodie does go for this dress, just if she does, with the overskirt, at least you've seen her in something that you really want to see her in. Mm. Should we do that? Right. You take Jodie that way, and I'm going to go and gag Nan. I just do not know what she's going to choose. I really don't want my Nan to know that I like this dress, but I do quite like this dress. It's <sighs> lovely. She just looked as us a model just trying to dress on. I knew this was going to happen. I knew this was going to happen. Your heart was set on the second dress. It was. And then Nana's gone out. And maybe, actually, Nana could be right. What do you think? I think she's done really well. The dress is lovely. Beautiful, Jordan. I love the, the low plunge with, like, the mesh in the middle. As much as I like the skirt, I absolutely love that other one on you. Well, what do you think? I just didn't react to it how I did to the second yeah. one. The second one was beautiful, but you demised it by putting that plain thing round it. What if it what wasn't plain? Know. You could see it pinned on you. What if it wasn't plain? You're still taking the beauty of the back of that dress. Right, you're missing the object of that. I'm oh, asking you a question. Show me something more pin on like that. <sighs> what look nice. I need to shut Nana up right now because I just can't take any more of these opinions. Okay. Going back down actually a second time in this dress and to walk in and to actually shake her head, it just really annoyed me. I just thought, why? Guys, what do we think? I love it. Mum? Yeah. Does she look gorgeous though? Yeah, she does from the front, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I can't change my opinion of what I think. You can't. No. But you why still... can't you not just support me in what I like though? Yeah. I like the back of that dress. Yeah, well, you will see the back of the bloody dress. When? We all agree she's gorgeous. Yeah, yeah exactly. she's gorgeous. She, she looks gorgeous. Beautiful. It's you. you. This is the one that you wanted. Oh, we've seen you in other dresses. None of them was no. like this. None of them was. I'm so happy she's come down in that dress. Beautiful. Absolutely amazing. Honestly, you look absolutely incredible. It literally matches you like a hand in a glove. You look beautiful.